Hey people, this is Let's Play Tales of the Abyss Part... I don't remember, 19 or 20. So, we are still in Kessidonia, but now that we've done all the sub quests, we can get the story out of the way. Wow, this place sure is packed. Except not right now, because we're in an inn. Well, you've got stuff coming in from all over the world. Agricultural products, medicines, things like that from Monku all pass through the consulate here in Kessidonia. Likewise, for, pro for products exported from Kimlaska. That distribution system supports all those meals you've had. Wow, all that food must have had a long trip. Kinda like us. So we're vegetables now? Oh, Luke, so literal. That wasn't very funny. Yay, no more skits. Get out the way, person. I don't really particularly care for this town. I find it boring. Talk to some guy named Aster. Oh my, phone master! I this guy creeps me out. I don't know what it is about him. You can't really see it right now, but maybe it's his. If only Tiny little mustache. I'd have prepared the fact that he wears pink clothes. It's fine. I don't really We're know. To keep a low he's just kind of creepy looking. And yet he's not evil. A mansion of this size probably has a phone disc analyzer or two. I see you have an eye for luxury. Yes, my home does in fact have an analyzer. Sounds like he's voiced by the same guy who voices Dist. Great. Phone master, would you be so kind as to request that they analyze that phone disc? Would you do that for us? Name it. The Kessadonia Merchants Guild is always at your service, Phone Master. Phone Master. We want to read the data from this phone disc. Stop saying phone disc. Leave it yeah, to there me. it is. You there. I really don't like his mustache. Or the fact that his big no his nose is pink. I don't know what it is with his this guy in pink. Analyze that phone disc and deliver the results to him. Yes, sir. Thank you. No problem. Let's get on with it. Ion, you know this guy? It's thanks to the phone master that we were able to establish this place of exchange on the border. The Merchants Guild contributes large amounts of money to Doth. In return, the order enforces the recognition of Kessidonia as an autonomous state. You must be really rich, Aster. Uh oh, and this is gold digger senses are going off. I can't handle it. Wow, I wish I lived in a place like this. Here are the results of the analysis, sir. That was fast. Thank. Little notebook. That's a lot. I guess we'll read them on the ship. Then let's be going. Thank you for your assistance. Anytime you need something, please, don't hesitate to let me know. <laughs> oh, creepy. No, I want to have to get something. I think it's in here. I can't remember. Can't even open that door. How rude of these people not to be having random people in their house and not allowing them full access to every room. I mean, what is this common courtesy? Mm -hmm. 
Um, for those of you wondering, that is a doll for Anis that turns Tokunaga into wearing what looks like, makes him look like the main character from Tales of Fantasia, um, which was the first Tales game. Um, Cress in Japanese and I think Kless in American. It's only ever come out on the Game Boy and Game Boy Advance in America, but it had a bunch of different remakes in Japan, which is very typical of this series. Ah, here you are. The ship is ready. Please come to the Kamlaska side oh, port. He talks fast. Look out! Uh oh. Hand those over. We shouldn't cause a scene here. To the ship. Damn it. Just don't give up. I like the scene of You're just not getting everyone away. Running. Run away. Master Luke, departure preparations are complete. Get this ship moving. Now. Excuse me? <laughs> Cock his head. Stupid We're being questions. chased. Hurry. Well, at least he had the decency to carry Mew with him. Oh! They got away! Oh, too bad. Some of the sound effects they make on this game are just so <laughs> weird. Looks like you blew this one, Sink. Oh, it's you. Leave the rest to me. Was that an ID badge? I never noticed that before. With my ultra super hyper high grade phonic technology, I'll flay that conniving long haired four. Oh, someone thinks highly of himself. <laughs> and he's already gone. <laughs> I like they even added a crow. Stop, stop, come back. I'm not done talking. I marked the one named Guy with a curse slot. I can make him my puppet at any time. That's not good. And totally not going to come into play later. As for you, make sure you properly dispose of those documents from the Fomacry project. Bye. Now, who do you think you are? Just you wait. I'm putting this down in my revenge journal. Revenge journal? This, that's a little lame. I still don't know where that sound is coming from because it doesn't have a steam thing coming off of it. Unless it's got a horn. Which would be odd. If we made it this far, we should be in the clear. Damn! I lost part of the documents when Sink attacked. Let me see them. Just gonna go back and lean against the wall. Looks like isophone research. 3.141592653589793238846. This is Lorelei's phone on frequency. Lorelei's pie? Oh man, that joke got so old when this game came out. Lorelei? Isophones? Phone on frequencies? What the heck are you talking about? Lorelei is the name for the aggregate sentience of the seventh phonon. When a certain amount of a particular phonon gathers together, it becomes sentient. Control that, and you can perform high-level phonic arts. So if a whole bunch of them get together, they just suddenly decide, oh hey, let's grow a brain and start thinking on our own. Each one has a name. The first phonon sentience is called Shadow. The sixth is called Rim, and so on. Summon spirits. Too bad you don't get to use Lorelei them. Lorelei still hasn't been observed. Its existence is hypothetical. Huh. How come all of you, you know like this stuff? Asleep. Well, it's actually common knowledge. It's okay, Luke. You can't help it. Just keep learning from here on and you'll be fine. Well, that conversation before certainly changed her opinion. Is it just me? Or are you being a lot nicer to Luke all of a sudden? I, I don't know what you mean. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, also, all matter emits a phonon frequency. They're like fingerprints. No two frequencies are the same. Well, that's nice. Way to change the subject. Very smooth. Be quiet, guy. Or I'll hug you. Isophones are two entities that have the exact same Normally that same wouldn't be a threat on a guy. Of course, but on guy, it is. They unless artificially created. Of course, if isophones were common, we'd have our hands full with hyper-resonances all over the place. Such big words. Isophone research holds potential for weapons development, so the military has their eye on it. That Thomacry technology they worked on a long time ago can make isophones, right? And more yeah. secrets. Thomacry is like a copy machine. Even right? Ion knows it. No, replicas created through Thomacry are mere imitations. A replica may look identical, but its phonon frequency is different. One can't produce isophones that way. Uh, what the hell are you all talking about? Enough of this complicated stuff. Jade can read those documents on his... Emergency! A large number of monsters and an unidentified phone tech signature approaching from Casadonia. Oh. Hello, soldiers. Oh no, they're here. Yes, here they are. Battle time. Why does Luke stagger so much? Don't turn around. That's easy. Jade, I was doing that. I'll do whatever it takes. Yep, and even if you didn't want to, I'd make you. Because you don't have a choice. I have a choice. That was very dark. Any day now. Thank you. Can we assume their goal is to stop Ion and the letter from reaching Kim Laska? You don't suppose they try to just sink the whole ship, do you? Master, what do we do? I can't swim! Shut up and drown. Oh, so mean. But if they intended to sink us, they wouldn't come storming aboard. You could just use your ring as a life then vest to or a flotation device because it already looks like one. So then, I guess we have to secure the bridge before they do, huh? Exactly. Why do those Oracle guys want to start a war so badly? What a pain. There's no time for complaints. Let's go. Yes, let's. But we do have time for a skit, which means we hang around and talk about it. You know, the whole ship is sinking and or being under attack and everything, but we're gonna talk about it. Arg, why do they keep attacking us? I like Jade's serious face. At tier at sea, there's nowhere to run. That's probably why they keep attacking. Oh, I wouldn't give them that much credit. Colonel, why do you look so relaxed? Didn't you just say we need to hurry? It's just your imagination. As you said, we ought to hurry to the bridge before things get worse. Yes, let's hurry. But first, we these these meticulously planned yet silly attacks remind me of. Well, I just hope my premonition turns out turns out to be groundless. Premonition, and more secrets. Saved a ship. We don't want Mew to drown. Oh, hello! I didn't even notice that was there. Do whatever it takes. Do, 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 do. Let's get out of here. I think this is when we have to chase that stupid little robot. Yep. Barrelo X. Looks like a wind up toy. It probably is. <sighs> Got it. Let's go. Wow, 
was easy. I remember one time I had so much trouble with that, and I don't remember. I don't realize. Don't know why. Oh, my ear is itchy. You're evil. But I'm scared. <laughs> Silly robot. And then he kills himself. Yes, we have. <laughs> Whoops. Noble, noble, or whatever, which I believe is a capacity core. Winged boots! I forget what those do. I think they increase the speed at which you run away from battle. And you can't even wear them. Oh, it's not an equipable item, that's right. Increases movement speed. Boss fight time. Where the heck is their leader? Let's hurry up and finish this. <laughs> I'm laughing sinisterly, sinisterly, and crazily at the same time. Listen, you ignorant savages, and you shall hear my beautiful name. No, thank you. I am the most graceful member of the six god generals, the one and only Dist the... Why, if it isn't Dist the Runny... Ooh, burn. The Rose! R-O-S-E, Rose! Dist the Rose! You mean Dist the Reaper. Silence! I refuse to accept that name. It's Rose. Rose! Okay, stop yelling. What, you know him? I'm in the Oracle Knights, too, so... But why do you know him, Colonel? I, the genius Dist, once counted that duplicitous snake Jade amongst my friends. Which Jade is that? I don't know any Jades with such poor taste in friends. <laughs> oh, Jade. What did you say? Ah, uh ah, -uh, careful now. You know how your nose runs when you get mad. Uh, no, it doesn't! This is stupid. They're off in their own little world. Enough of this. Now, hand over the phone disk data. You mean this? Oh, he moves fast in that chair. <laughs> How careless, Jade. You can have them. I've already memorized their contents. Wow, that's pretty impressive. Gah, I'm being mocked by savages. I'm throwing a temper tantrum. When you taste the pain of my super, ultra gorgeous arts, you'll regret what you've done. You don't even battle. You get a stupid machine to battle for you, unless you're piloting it or your chair turns into it. Knight is not doing any damage. Jade new splash, but he doesn't. This is gonna take forever.
I don't remember there being this below leveled or this weak in strength right? Every time, whenever I've done this before. Yes, this thing just has ridiculously high defense. I really wish you wouldn't stand so close. God, still 11,000 health. Kill the robot. Slowly kill the robot. Tear, will you stop burning through your TP? Well, I guess if you're using it to heal, it doesn't particularly matter. He's turning red. Yeah, I've got 8,000 health left. Beating him down. I need to stop doing that. It ruins combos. Starting to begin. Trying to look with aim correctly. Back here. Jade, why are you trying to be a close range fighter? You are not a close range fighter. Well, that guy is only doing one damage per hit. I swear I'm actually pretty good at this game. It's just these early fights and this, these videos don't appear to be showing it. Do I have any more? Yeah, I do have two more. Luke, I told her to get over it. Almost dead? Yes, you are. Boom! Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and stop the video here, so next time we'll be heading to Baticle. So, uh, see ya later.